Preface of The Romance of the Ship. This is a LibriVox recording. All LibriVox recordings are in the public domain. For more information or to volunteer, please visit LibriVox.org. Read by Betty B. The Romance of the Ship by Edward Kebble Chatterton. Preface To attempt to describe within the limits of one book the whole evolution of the ship from the days of her crude beginnings and limited utility to the present time when she has become so essential a feature of modern life may seem to be an ambitious scheme the term ship denotes so much and includes so many different types that it would be utterly impossible to deal with the subject fully in any single book of moderate dimensions and for all but a few readers such a volume would be not only too large but too technical what i have had in my mind has been to inspire those who are interested in the following chapters with a keen desire to seek for fuller information elsewhere and with this object in view i have endeavored to present not so much a catalogue of the varying characteristics of vessels in all ages as a vivid picture of the gradual growth of this most romantic of the works of man and a general idea of its development in so many and wonderful ways what is here set forth is the fruit of a good many years of historical research and of personal practical experience due to a natural love of the sea an enthusiasm for what seems to me one of the most fascinating studies in the whole range of knowledge of the shortcomings of this book no one is more conscious than the writer himself but if the vast range of the subject and the difficulty of sustaining the reader's interest whilst keeping the great mass of details within bounds as well as the task of making a highly technical subject intelligible to those unfamiliar with sea terms be considered he trusts that some slight indulgence may be granted him e kebble chatterton 1910 end of preface